hello everyone welcome back to the channel today today we're officially doing a third member that is that or that was from got seven i've done uh jb and i've done jackson wang of course and today we're doing bam bam and his shoot from maps magazine korea november 2021 um i'm excited i feel like you know Got Seven's been around for quite some years, and they've done so many photo shoots um, for their comebacks and stuff, and their solo releases, and for magazines. Um, and I should really get into it. I should really get into it. I can't wait to get into all the other members and their shoots they've done. Um, but today we got Bam Bam, and I'm excited. Um, I don't think I've... There's maybe been, like, maybe two other shoots I've seen from Bam Bam. I know he's done more, obviously, but I've only seen, like, been aware of, like, two other ones. Um, and I'm excited to see what those are like. Actually, if you guys could tell me some shoots from from Bam Bam that you guys really like that you check out, be it like you know music releases or from editorials or magazine, let me know below because I really want to check some more out from him. But yeah, let's get started. Okay, so the first image is this cover. I actually like this. I like how the shovel his hair is. Um, the lips are on full, full, and I like how his ears stick out like this. Now, um. If you've probably seen my past videos, I'm always kind of like questioning if the idols actually have uh, pierced earrings. And the answer is always yes, according to you guys. You guys are like, yep, those are real. Um, I guess for some reason in my mind, I'm thinking like anytime I see a tattoo or a piercing, I'm thinking it's just for the video, for the performance, for the shoot. It's not actually on them. But then lots of times, they are really tatted. They really do have those piercings. So I want to assume his ears are really pierced here. Um, and you guys also may or may not know, you probably do if you've been subscribed, I love portraits, so this is right up my alley to have this hash out of him, I love the shadows, I think it's kind of cool, it, it reminds me of the 90s with this green light that you're using with this, it's giving me kind of a grunge kind of vibe, so I'm zooming into the, to the necklace, I like this, a strong first image, oh, this image. Is he from the Gote 13? Is he a Shinigami? I absolutely love this. So he switched up the backdrop. Now it's a yellow color with the green light still. And let me figure out what is going on with this outfit. Let me see. So it looks like a hoodie pulled up. Yeah, it was pulled up with a jacket over it. It was a high-waisted pants with a belt. I like this a lot. He's giving me Soul Reaper vibe. Because cause what I'm seeing is, because you know the Soul Reapers, the, the Gote 13, they have like the black um, uniform with the white over it to, to, to signify that they are the captain of the, of the Gote 13. This reminds me of that. And I love the jawline, the expression, the movement, um, the contrast between the, the green light and the yellow light. I like this a lot. But anyway, he really, and he has this mullet now. I'm not sure if he's always had it for a while, because I remember seeing maybe the concept photos of his he did for a solo debut or release he did recently, or somewhat recently. I um, mean, he had his, like, shorter hair. Um, so here he has, like, a mullet. I'm kind of digging it. Like, sometimes when you get these, uh, these idols get these mullets. Sometimes they be kind of, like, crunchy crunch, but sometimes they be lit lit. And this is lit lit, in my opinion. Next image. Absolutely stunning. Mm-hmm. I love this. Yes, yes, he's not looking at the camera in our direction, and it's like kind of like, who is this? But that's why I like it. It is so like eerie and strange. Um, it's moody. Uh, my very interesting sweatshirt here. A very interesting sweatshirt, which I kind of I want I want to know. I kind of want to see it from the front now, kind of see what it actually looks like. But it is really cool looking. This kind of looks like something you'll use for your album um cover. Like if you crop this in a square, I can see this as an album cover. I really can. I really can. Next image. Okay, so this is like an alternate image from that cover shot. I love the styling a lot. This hoodie. Okay, now. Okay. So before. Oh, wait a minute. Got it. Okay, now I see. So he doesn't have his hand in the hoodie sleeve, but the hoodie sleeve is outside. So he might just have the hoodie on his shoulders. They put the jacket on and then they put the hoodie on, but he's not. His hands are not in the sleeves. The sleeves are out, which one is draping over the back. I didn't notice that in the other one. 
I thought I thought he had one hand, one arm under from under, <laughs> not from under, one hand that's not in the sleeve, obviously, because you know we saw the side shot. But I didn't know where the other hand was, and I think they're he he doesn't have his hands in them in the in the hoodie. It's just over his head, on top of the jacket. Um, I really like this. I like the body language. I love the shadows, um, on his face. It is so moody and dramatic. I guys, in the shape and the lines of the shadows with the sweatshirt and the jacket, it. This is up my alley. This is what I came here for. Come on, Bam Bam. I need to stop sleeping on Bam Bam. I need to like get into more of his shoes. Please, please let me know more stuff from him. Like, please link me some photos he's done that you guys really love. Cause homeboy is serving. Oh, this next image. What is this shirt? Who's who, okay? I don't know who this is. I thought it was Ryuk from. Is that his name from Death Note? Like at first glance, I was like, um, but I don't think that's. I don't know who that is. Um, I do like the pose here. I have a photo shoot coming up. I think I'm still his pose. I think I'm still his pose. I like this pose. You have the leg turned this way, arm up. Uh, uh. Now I wish he would have wearing um. Maybe have some like pants tucked into the boot. I think I would like that more. Cause it's giving me PJs right now, and I'm, I don't think they're trying to serve us PJs. But that's the vibe I'm getting. Cause I like this shirt, and I wish I just wish the pants were like uh, shorts were pants into the into the boot. Um, but I like this. They got the orange backdrop in this pose. Like I said, I like I like it a lot. Okay, I dig this. Next image. Okay, first of all, this jacket. This like leather pleather jacket. Okay. You can't really tell because it's like so dramatically shot with a moody light, but there's like a bunch of belts, at least two belts wrapped around him. And my favorite color is green. I love this deep, deep green they're using here. I love this color a lot. So I'm like, this already, you know. Now I wish he was kind of like, not doing this, but kind of like doing this and kind of looking at the camera. I think that would have been, been a serve. I mean, it still is a serve, don't get me wrong, but I think I would have liked it a bit more if he was just kind of like, more menacing, look at the camera really intently um, with his armor pit in the same position, everything on my other knees, but just kind of like, you know, this image, he about to bust down. Hold up. Okay, so we have this, um, what brand is this? The one with the, they, they use the moons as their motif. I forgot the name of that brand, but he has their sweatshirt on. And then he has these sweatpants on, but they don't seem like regular regular sweatpants. I don't think they are. Nope, I don't think they are. Um, and they might be, actually. They just kind of, like, really elevated with this chain, which I like. I like this. I like this. And his pose. He is grind on me. Bam Bam's jawline is sharp. It is sharp. I didn't realize... I never noticed how his jaw might be in that, like, in the chin, too. Come on, Bam Bam. Okay, next, this image. Wait a minute. This image might be my favorite. <laughs> wait, 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 wait. Maybe, maybe not, maybe not. I don't know. But I really like it. This blue gradient with this, with this, um, not, not a uh, robe, but kind of like a robe, a long coat. I think with this, he should have had, like, no shorts on or, like, no pants on with this and covered up with this. Um, but I, I still do like it a lot. Like like I said, his jawline, this posing is simple. He's cozy up with this big old shawl of a robe thingy. I like this. Is his foot actually tattooed? It probably is. It's probably tattooed, for real. Um, this could have been one of the covers, honestly. Honestly, I like this a lot. Speaking of, the next one is I'll turn up to that cover. I still like it. Now, I do prefer the cover shot, the image they chose for that one over this one, but I, I still enjoy this as well. Another option to pick from. Next, we have this image. I absolutely love this so much. The choker, the jacket, we got the peekaboo with the Nikes, we got these shorts that match the jacket. We got that boo, we got this black chair, the white and the red in the backdrop, the hair, how he's sitting, 10, 10, 10, 10, 10. 
I love this. Tense across the board for this image. Yep. Yep. I love this. The shadows are soft. The color tones are creamy. I like this. And that was the last image. Okay, so let's pick our favorite. I'm going to say it. That last image was my favorite. Yeah, I absolutely love this. This is like something I would do myself. It speaks to me. It speaks to my spirit. Um, out of the two covers, though, I picked through this cover right here with the hoodie and stuff on there. I absolutely love this so much. It's such a great shoot from him. This is such a great shoot. I really love this, y'all. And I can't wait for y'all to tell me some more shoots about him from him. I mean, and I can't wait to get into it because he really did what he needed to do on this shoe. And I enjoyed it thoroughly. <laughs> All right, guys, if you guys want to help support the channel, please consider becoming a patron. There's extra content on there. And if you enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up. Make sure you guys subscribe and I will see you guys in the next one.